You ever been on a plane, minding your own business, when suddenly it feels like you're riding a roller coaster? That, my friends, is turbulence. It's like hitting a rough patch of road, except you're thousands of feet in the air. Turbulence happens when the air that planes fly through gets all stirred up. Think of a river. A calm river is smooth sailing, but rapids mean you're in for a bumpy ride. Same deal with air. There are a few things that can cause this air to get chopped. Storms are a big one, but so are jet streams. Those are like rivers of wind high in the atmosphere, and even mountains can make the air do funky things. The good news is, turbulence is way more uncomfortable than it is dangerous. Planes are built to handle a whole lot of shaking and rattling. It's like driving a tank through a bouncy house. A little wild, but you're gonna be just fine. We all know storms can be a real drag. They bring rain, wind, and sometimes even hail. But did you know they're also a major culprit behind those bumpy flights? See, storms are like giant mixing bowls for the air. You've got warm, moist air rising up, cold air rushing down, and winds swirling all over the place. It's a recipe for one heck of a turbulent ride. Imagine a pot of boiling water. The water bubbling up is like the warm air rising in a storm. Now, picture that water sloshing around. That's the turbulence caused by all that air movement. One type of turbulence you might hear about is called clear air turbulence. Don't let the name fool you, it can still give you a good jostling. This type often happens near those jet streams I mentioned earlier. It's like two powerful currents colliding, not exactly smooth sailing. Now you might be thinking, if the air gets that crazy, how do pilots even fly the plane? Well, I'm here to tell you, these men and women are pros. They train for this stuff, like firefighters train for, well, fires. Pilots have a whole bunch of fancy instruments that tell them what the weather's doing up there. They can see storms coming from a mile away, literally. And if they do hit a rough patch, they know exactly what to do. Sometimes they can just fly around the turbulence. Think of it like taking a detour around a traffic jam. Other times, they might adjust their altitude to find smoother air. It's like finding a calm spot in a choppy sea. And if things get really bumpy, pilots might turn on the fasten seatbelt sign. That's your cue to sit tight and let them do their thing. They've got this. Section four, tough as nails planes built for bumps and bruises. Let's talk about airplanes for a minute. These things are built tougher than a $2 steak. They're designed to withstand way more force than any turbulence can dish out. Think of it this way. When a plane hits turbulence, it's like flicking a ruler on the edge of a desk. The ruler might vibrate, but it's not going to snap in half. Planes are built with the same kind of flexibility and strength. Plus, Engineers test the heck out of these things before they ever see the sky. They shake them, rattle them, and put them through the ringer to make sure they can handle anything Mother Nature throws their way. So next time you're feeling a little jostled on a flight, remember, you're in a machine that's tougher than a junkyard dog. Relax, you're in good hands. Section five, buckle up, buttercup busting turbulence myths. Now let's clear the air about some common turbulence myths. First off, turbulence is not going to make the plane fall out of the sky. I know it can feel like that sometimes, but trust me, it's not happening. Second, turbulence is not something that happens all the time. Most flights are pretty smooth sailing. Think of turbulence like a speed bump on the highway to the sky. A little bump, but you're still getting where you need to go. And here's the big one. Wearing your seatbelt during turbulence is crucial. That little strap is your best friend when the going gets rough. It keeps you from bouncing around the cabin like a pinball. Section six, safe and sound. Your captain's got this. The next time you find yourself on a flight and the plane hits a little turbulence, remember this, you're in good hands. The pilots are trained professionals and the plane is built to handle it. Turbulence is a normal part of flying, like traffic jams are a normal part of driving. It's not fun, but it's rarely dangerous. Just sit back, relax, and let the professionals do their thing. And for Pete's sake, keep that seatbelt fastened. It's not just a suggestion, 
it's your ticket to a safe and comfortable flight. Fly safe, my friends.